I'm Dr. David Hilton. I'm the Associate Dean of Mathematics and Natural Sciences here at Chipola College. And today we hosted our first uh, spring STEM event. We had students arrive from 13 different high schools this morning. Uh, they got here between 8.30 and 9 o'clock. Uh, we started the day assigning their, own, their teachers from their schools, assigned them to one of five different labs in pairs so that they could work together. But they were given a brief scenario to set the stage as to what we were doing. And today's event was entitled, Who Killed Lois MacArthur? So once they got the story, uh, they went to one of five labs. blood spatter lab, which uses physics to determine the trajectory of, of blood. Then we had a lab that both detected blood type and also luminol. Where was the blood? lab was fiber analysis and fingerprinting. fourth lab was a titration, but it was for blood alcohol levels, so we could determine the, the, the level of alcohol, whether someone was capable of doing the crime. And then the fifth lab, which is really a neat thing for them to be able to experience it, uh, was a PCR DNA lab. So evidence from all five labs was put together, plus alibi information and crime scene details. And so uh, it was great today, all 13 schools picked the right person. We also today uh, had speakers from the police department here in town that just talked about the part that we didn't do today, which was collecting evidence and the chain of custody and things they, they need to understand would have been done before the lab experience that they had today. We then recognized four students from each of the labs, uh, two pairs that had done exemplary work that really paid attention to detail and did a really good job. Uh, all five of the Chipola instructors that um, handed out the awards just went on and on about how all the students did such a great job. And so that was good to hear. So the students were recognized, they were very happy. It was a neat little award they received, but it was really just to let them know how hard they worked. Everyone seemed to have enjoyed the day. And as I said, all 13 schools arrived at the same uh, uh, conclusion. So it was a good day for us, it was a really good day.